Welcome to All Signs Tarot. This is a daily love reading for the sign of Capricorn for the 19th of April 2022. Holy Spirit, show me the Capricorns who need to hear these messages today. Who are the Capricorns who need to hear these messages, please? Show me the Capricorns who need to hear these messages. Why are you spitting cards, man? Let's see. Ta da! Knight of Swords, maybe you're on the cusp of Capricorn and Aquarius, or you could be talking about something today. Um, you might be in a rush to communicate something with somebody, or you might get angry, you might get impatient about something. You saw how the Knight of Swords, boom, went far away. I had to look for it. So we've got Ten of Pentacles and Seven of Pentacles. That's definitely Capricorn energy here. So you might be talking to a family member. You might be actually might be communicating the fact that you're pregnant. It could be. Or you're communicating something um, to your family members. Maybe about your work. Nine of Cups reversed. You're not happy. Oh. Actually, somebody might uh, communicate to their family that they lost a baby or they lost a pregnancy. Some, oh my God, no. I hope this is not the case. Somebody could be rushed to the hospital because they, they might be... Well, maybe they're giving birth. But... Because you see, the Knight of Swords could be a fast vehicle. And the Knight of Swords rushed, uh, flew away very far when I dropped it from the deck. So it could be that somebody's going to have to pick you up or you're going to have to pick somebody up because either they're giving birth or they're losing um, pregnancy. There might be an emergency today for somebody. What kind of emergency is this? Please clarify. Yeah, you might be the one who's helping the other person or you might be the person who is in the situation. I'm not sure. Eight of Cups, King of Cups... Ten of Wands. There could be a Scorpio involved here. Could be an older person. You might have to rush an older person to the hospital too. Or there's a man. Ten of Wands. Somebody might collapse. Somebody might get injured while they are lifting weights also. Or somebody will have to carry another person, literally have to carry another person somewhere. Because the person might collapse. What exactly is happening? Is this... A, 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 and te Oh, Ten of Wands could also talk about pregnancy. Somebody could just go into labor, possibly. But it there might be an emergency here. So there might be um, an emergency situation. It might not just be um, like a regular labor or something like that. Whew, okay. So what's going to happen here exactly? Six of Pentacles. Somebody's going to need help. That's what I'm getting. You or you might need help or you might be the one who's offering help to somebody. Knight of Cups. Somebody's going to need medical uh, intervention here. Six of Pentacles represents Virgo, which is the healer of the Zodiac. Yeah, more Virgo energy. Queen of Pentacles. So, also this could be a mother. Queen of Pentacles could be a mother. This is a mother who's going to need help. Either delivering a baby. You might have to help deliver a baby. I don't know. Or you might have to rush somebody to the hospital to deliver the baby. Um... Is this going to be safe? Is is this person going to be safe? Whoever this person is who's pregnant. Ten, oh no. Go, God. Somebody might pass away. I don't even want to give this message out. Why am I giving... Why, why am I uh, receiving this message... How does this help? Because it doesn't really help anyone. Is there anything that can be done to avoid this? Holy Spirit, is there anything that can be done to avoid this? Nine of Pentacles, Seven of Swords, Three of Pentacles. This person might need to be... Maybe take them to the hospital now. When you get this message, either you go to the hospital immediately or take the person to the hospital immediately. 
as soon as possible. Do not, do not avoid this. Do not uh, uh, run away from this responsibility or something. This person might need urgent intervention, right? The Seven of Swords makes me think of a surgeon who's running, rushing with knives. I know Seven of Swords means something else usually, but in this particular context, I see the Seven of Swords as somebody with the knives, with the, you know, preparing for an intervention. Also, somebody might be um, mishandling um, surgical... Um, what do you call it? Uh, whatever. Somebody might be mishandling the instruments for surgery and they might cause an infection or something. I don't know. If you're a doctor yourself, be careful not to use infected, um, you know what, whatever, scalpels or whatever that is. So if you're the doctor, Nine of Pentacles, again, is Virgo, the doctor, the healer of the Zodiac. If you are a doctor, be very careful what you're doing with um, with the instruments because this person might have an infection or something. Or somebody else in your team uh, might be doing something um, bad, something wrong with, with the instruments or with the medicine. I'm not sure. Somebody in your team, a team, right? This could be a doctor, this could be a team of doctors. This is somebody doing something nefarious, maybe on purpose even, because Seven of Swords is somebody who is a, a thief or a liar or something. Or they could be missing, um, you might be missing, what do you call it, um, the proper medication or the proper instruments, because somebody could have been stealing or something like that. I don't know what the hell this is. So let's see, are you the doctor or are you the patient here? Is Capricorn the doctor here? Knight of Pentacles. You might be the pregnant woman. Oh my god. Six of Cups. You're the pregnant woman. Okay, how can I help this person? Is there anything, is there any advice I can give this person? Eight of Swords. Six of Cups. What's the advice, please? Ace of Cups, Ace of Swords. You need to talk to somebody about the heartbeat, maybe. Ah, okay, okay. You know, when um, when women are, are pregnant, they're sometimes monitored. Um, if they don't feel the heartbeat, the baby's heartbeat, or uh, for a longer time, they need to go to the hospital to be uh, like wrapped in um, this thing that's measuring the heartbeat, okay? That's what I'm seeing, the Eight of Swords here. So you need to go and uh, monitor your bump, right? Tell them that you don't feel heartbeats or something like that, even if it's not true, okay? Just so that you can stay in the hospital, okay? That's what I'm getting. Yeah, even if you... Yeah, even if you have to lie, just say that you don't, you haven't felt the heartbeats in a while or something like that, and that you want to be monitored and stay in the hospital. Seven of Wands. What's the Eight of Pentacles? Two of Cups. Again, go to the doctor, you know, uh, stand up for yourself. Um, Talk to the doctor about this. Tell them what is going on. Five of Wands. What's with the Five of Wands? What's the Five of Wands? Four of Wands. Oh my God, you might be in an, in an abusive relationship. Your husband might be abusing you and you need to... In order to protect the li your life, oh my God, and your baby's life, you need to talk about what's going on in your relationship because somebody's abusing you. And it might lead to you losing your life. Oh, God. Who should, who should you talk to about this? Yeah, like, you could use... You could... I don't know. 
in order to get away from the abuser, you could use this excuse that you don't feel the baby's heartbeat and you want to be monitored. And when you're in the hospital, talk to somebody about helping you. Anything else? What other advice do we have? Holy Spirit, what other advice do we have for Capricorn? Free of Wands. 5, 4, free. There's a countdown. You're running out of time. You're running out of time. Go as soon as possible to the hospital. What else? King of Pentacles. Something about a, a father figure or an authority figure here. You might need to talk to the authorities. Maybe you need to talk to your father about this if you still have a father, if he's still alive. Or, yeah, again, Eight of Pentacles, King of Pentacles, or your boss. Maybe you need to talk to your boss about this. Somebody who is in authority. Six of Cups. Yeah, definitely your father. Or talk to the authorities about your child that you're concerned about your pregnancy. Queen of Wands. Who's the Queen of Wands? What's the Queen of Wands? Clarify the Queen of Wands. Ace of Pentacles, Six of Wands, Four of Swords. Uh, this could be somebody you don't talk to. Maybe you and your father are estranged. Maybe you don't talk to this person, but you need to talk to them. You need to ask for this person's help, maybe. Two of Wands. You need to make a decision, right? You need to make a plan. What's the plan? What plan should you make? The fool to run away. To run away from, yeah, eight of, yeah, the fool and the eight of wands. You need to devise a plan on how to get away from your abusive husband because he might end up killing you. He will, actually, and your child if you're pregnant. So you might need to ask a parent, father or mother. Um, in the previous reading I did for Sagittarius, it was showing me that somebody was concerned about their child. So maybe your parent could be a Sagittarius or if you're the Sagittarius, um, you might be cross-watching the, the Capricorn reading to find out what's happening with your child. Yeah, because for Sagittarius, I kept seeing the Knight of Pentacles, the Queen of Pentacles, representing the child. So this might be the child of the Sagittarius in the previous reading I just did. So if you're the Sagittarius, you need to save your child quickly. You need to go and get your child, even if you don't talk. It doesn't matter how it ended between you and your child. You need to remove them because either they or their child or both of them will be um, over. So, this is an emergency. This is an emergency message for somebody. That's all. Take care.